Oh, do I have a fun one for you today. We are multiplying all my items by 1,000, but this time, the enemies get items too, and they are also multiplied by 1,000. So once I get to Mithrix, it truly will be a fight between gods. And that is if I got to Mithrix. Let me run you through this first run very quickly. Everything started out fine. We had a cautious slug as a thousand items for the enemies and a very quick teleporter one. We got a gorse tome, we had gasoline. We were feeling lovely. Move on to stage two, enemies have crowbars. Oh, what's that? A forgive me please? Stage two, not a problem at all. We go, we grab our rose buckler and off to stage three. Stage three, they get death mark. Who cares, Z construct? See you later. Stage three, again, passes no issue. Stage four, they get ice bands. Was that a problem? No, no it was not. Imp overlord stood no chance. And then we got to stage five. And here is where the problem arose. Enemies got 1,000 Dio's, and now I understand that you understand that's not ideal, and and clearly this is why we're against a Z construct here with 1,000 lives. Now, of course, I have all the items to kill them in one shot and to survive forever, but the problem with having to kill a Z construct 1,000 times and having Gore's Tome is we started to lag a little bit and by a little bit i mean a lot until eventually i ran out of frames and we just could not defeat the run and so now i present to you the actual run of me and enemies with 1000 times items enemies with 1000 tri-tip daggers mean they're a pretty much a hundred percent chance to bleed on hit very interesting way to start this run. Our first item to help us out. Well, we we can't touch that. Ooh, a fuel cell. That's going to be super helpful once I open this equipment barrel. I might actually do it now just to get my damage up. Hopefully. Oh, I don't have money. Hopefully it is a damage equipment. And ew. Ew, that's not good. I mean, any equipment can be good with a thousand uses of it, but still. Also, in case you're wondering why uh, our DPS meter looks like that, I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea why it's saying negative 12 billion or whatever. Uh, I know, oh, ouch, the bleed. I know, I mean, last run, like, technically we had a ton of damage, so it's probably, like, remnants from that last run. Ow, ooh, I'm, like, scared. These wisps are actually kind of a problem. All right, we're chilling. We need some health. We need some health up in here, and then we're going to be good to go. Oh, I could just do this. Wait, that's way easier. Look, <laughs> look at this. Oh, wait, okay. Yeah, with the 255 of these, although technically 1,000, we're, we're good. And we are given, oh, yeah, yeah. A focus crystal and regen scrap. Very nice. I need some, uh, some healing and some damage reduction really, really badly. We've solved our healing problem right here with 1,000 monster teeth. That's going to be very, very nice. And here, ooh, I mean, Sticky Bomb is great. I'm kind of tempted to do War Banner, call me crazy. But I think, I think I am going to do the Sticky Bomb for now. And then to help us survive and thrive, let's grab a thousand Power Elixirs. There we go. Now the bleed is a lot less scary. It can slowly whittle us down, but I'm nowhere near as worried that I was as I was before. Also, the, these things are going to be amazing on the boss. I'm really hoping we get a Titan or a Beetle Queen. And is that? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Give me, uh... Actually, give me a lot. Give me a lot of watches. Give me that damage. How's our damage looking? Nine million? Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Let's see how crazy this is. Here we go. Be oh, Beetles. Beetles? Be gone. Be absolutely gone. And I think our final chest is going to be a bleed chest. There we go. Now we get the bleed. I'll see how these guys like it. All right, time for teleporter. Feeling very good so far. What do we got for an enemy? Of course, it's the aerial enemy. We're just going to do this. Oh, my. I mean, I guess that checks out. We do have that many watches. Uh, we could just throw all these guys out everywhere, and we are going to kill everything so far. And having a guillotine means elite enemies basically don't exist. Stage one has been complete. The items are feeling spicy. Enemies have received... Uh-oh. Oh, that's probably not good. Enemies have received uh, personal shield generators. Now, this is probably not the end of the world, actually. Because we do just an ungodly amount of damage, 
I think we can probably swipe right through this. Good, 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 we can. That is huge to know, that we can still one-shot enemies, because without it, we could be in a lot of trouble. Ooh, and an opal is going to be super helpful for any sort of big attacks enemies have. We can deal with it that way. We're going to keep using our Molotovs uh, strategically, because we only have a thousand of them, so we got to be very careful. One item we are very much looking for, and I'll never say this outside of a thousand items video, is a Hunter's Harpoon. Hunter's Harpoons are actually really nice. Oh, this is beautiful. Hunter's Harpoons are extremely nice with a thousand items because you don't have to worry about extreme speed. It only increases the duration of the speed as opposed to like a goat hoof, which you're going to be flying across the map at Mach 7. Oh, what I'm seeing a repulsion armor plate. Oh, I can't afford it, but that is going to be super helpful. I love any sort of damage reduction because these enemies could get brilliant behemoth. They could just straight up get watches. They can get crowbars. Anything that increases damage is something I want to mitigate as fast as possible. A mountain shrine is definitely doable at this stage in the game. I'm not too worried about that, so we'll we'll grab an extra green. More power elixir certainly doesn't hurt. We are looking to just get as beefy as possible because you never know what those greens or those reds are going to be. Ooh, a void cradle I almost missed. This could be this could be beautiful. Let me do this. Let me uh, make sure that wherever they land, they're going to get absolutely obliterated. So that's good. And a key. Okay. Okay, I can live with that. Our last item before teleporter is crit glasses. So now we have harvester scythe and crit. The crit obviously doesn't really matter, but the scythes are going to be nice. Stone Titan. All right, let's deal with this really quickly. Where is the other one? Here he is. He's got a shield and goodbye. What do we get for our greens? A neural and a band. Hell yeah. That neural boosts our health up to 40,000. So the bleed is now no longer an issue. But if enemies get something like an ATG, we are in a lot of trouble. This is extremely satisfying to just do as many as you can. Look at how just bright white this is. <laughs> Anything that walks in here instantly takes millions of damage. All right, stage two is complete. The items are feeling good. We're feeling pretty solid right now. I'm very scared of this green though. And the enemies are given, okay, fire bands. I, I can deal with this. I just have to kind of avoid any sort of interaction with enemies. Because if I get hit by that, we're in a big, big spot of trouble. Now, I don't know what enemies actually deal damage enough to proc a band. That I do not know. And so I don't really want to find out ideally. But we'll, uh, maybe we'll see. Okay, we already have watches. We don't have crowbars. And I do just for the... Are we getting... Yeah, 998 million if we're using uh, focus crystal damage. Which, I mean, I hope to all the time. But you never really know. All right, something huge. Something absolutely massive out of here. Okay, so I don't know what we're doing with that. That's not that helpful. Okay, here's what I'm thinking here, right? We have the Bungus and we have the Backup Mag, which are both extremely helpful. But the roll of pennies, I think, is going to be what I take here. Because if I just get hit by, like, a little wisp or something, I mean, we're good. Let's see what this guy does to me. Yeah, there we go. There is 56,000 gold. I do not want to get hit by the bison. I would imagine that procs a ban. But now we have enough gold to loot the entire stage. So that'll, you know, save us a lot of time. And there's our backup bag. Anyway, we're in a great spot. A large chest, me a red, and an infusion. I think that only stacks to three at the maximum, so not super helpful. But we'll hit another and another. Give me something big. More bands. Did I just get double bands out of these? What the heck? And it was one of each band? I mean, hey, I'm going to take it, but what are the chances? All right, this can't possibly be a Molotov six-pack, right? There's no way. Uh, okay. A cube is cool, I guess. I don't actually know if it's that helpful. We don't have any area of effect stuff right now. We don't have any gasoline, any will-o'-wisp. So that actually might not be too bad. War banner. There it is. There it is. Give me that. Love to see it. Healing. More power elixirs all day. 100%. No qualms with that. Give me that war banner speed. War banner attack speed. Yep, 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 yep. All right. You have to be better than a cube and a Molotov. And it's a blast shower. And it's a blast shower. And it's just a bl What are we doing out here? Oh, and there's the gasoline. And, and it's GG. And it's GG. Goodbye, everyone. I mean, it's not GG. We could most certainly get... Dio's as their red, which I would not enjoy. But we're feeling good right now. Let's get some more protection. Protection is going to be one of the biggest pieces here. All right, let's do teleporter. We're feeling very good. Let's get in there. I'm going to put down a cube right there just for fun. 
Not too concerned with the uh, Imp Overlord has for me. And goodbye everyone on the entire map. Love that. And uh, we get a Leptin Daisy. Sure. I'm going to I'm gonna cut here so you don't have to listen to this thing for the next 90 seconds. Look at these little nerds. I got them stuck in there. Goodbye. Oh, it's just so satisfying. Okay, and this isn't going to change much either, but we might as well grab one of these. We have uh, just a million regen scrap, so why not? And we get our void key looking like... Eh, well, you know, eh. Maybe, maybe, you know what? I think we probably do void crit here. I think we do void crit because now we instantly kill everything, which means as long... I mean, we already were... But as long as we can make contact with anything at all, we'll be okay. Oh yeah, and we have now a million Void Crit because of how the mod works. Love that part. Okay, War Banners. Okay. Okay, no, I got it. We're chilling. Ooh, and we get one of these right off the bat, which we're absolutely gonna do. Goodbye, and there's Tenta Bauble anyway. I love that. Uh, PSG, absolutely. And Mother War Banner, 100%. Uh, Large chest. Give me something spicy, Eddie. Okay, I mean, that's not terrible. I don't think we're gonna get to that point, but it's not a bad item. Oh, I just realized the item that these guys got is another Fire Band. I, I forgot to check. I totally forgot to. They have 2,000 Fire Bands. It's kind of a good roll. All right, I've gotten my pennies for the stage, and now we kill everything. 274,000 gold. Let's open up these two. Come on, red, you know you want to. Oh, squid polyp is fine, though, and a bison steak. All right, you have to be a better equipment. You just must. It has to be done. And an egg. Okay, okay, I think I mess around with an egg a little bit. It's not, like, the best. We could be looking at, you know... A royal capacitor could be fun, a couple other things could be fun, but an egg is not bad. Basically, infinite mo uh, moveability, maneuverability, infinite movement forever, which we already kind of have on Mercenary, but I'll take. You go, Ailey times a thousand is simply spectacular. Wax quail, we're not touching that, no siree, and might as well grab a mystery here. We already have all the bands, and yup! Yep, I can't even hit anybody. Our squid turrets are going crazy. I don't know if we have a stun grenade yet, so we're going to take a thousand of them. Absolutely. And then another void cradle. I don't know where our void key is. We can most certainly find that in a second. And a uh, wongus. And a uh, wongus. Yeah, that health has come back quick. All right, adaptive chest. I don't really know what we want here because we kind of have all the... Yeah. Oh, I kind of was hoping for the armor piercers. I'm going to be honest with you, because we are not about to grab speed. All right, a cooler equipment. Give it to me. Oh, that's not it. Well, I mean, hey, to be totally fair, that's actually really good. But I worry we're going to get like teddies or something. And easiest choice of my life. I'm worried we're going to get like teddies. And if we get teddies, we don't take damage. And then we don't get any money and that's useless. But we are hitting a mountain shrine. And uh, we'll keep looting. Berserker's Pauldron is a sure. Why not? And then we'll check out the legendary. Come on. Give me like a Dio's. Give me a Dio's. Come on. Come on. Oh, that's not it. That's not what we're looking for. Squid Polyp and Caffeinator. So we don't have any fireworks. We can't really cheese that at all. So we're going to leave that on the floor. Another adaptive chest. Come on. Something cool in here. I don't even know what I want. Oh, yeah. That'll work. That'll work 100%. That's just satisfying. Because now we can just go up here, no worries in the world, check out anything we want to, and we got freedom of movement everywhere. One more equipment, why not? What do we get? Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I actually kind of messed with the egg a little bit, but there was an equipment drone somewhere over here that I want to find. Here it is. I think I'm going to give that the, uh, the big guy. I think that's the play. I don't think we, uh, I don't think we need it. I think the egg is going to work just fine just for mobility's sake, even though I know we have, we have the jumps. Okay. All right. Teleporter time. Feeling very, very nice. What do we got? Stone Titan? Not anymore. It's just that simple. I'm, uh, more bands. This is a band filled run. I'm a little bit worried on what our first legendary is going to be. I have to make sure I don't pick that up by accident. But our first legendary comes next stage, and then stage six, we get another legendary. So, obviously, we have to be very cautious about that. Another band. We have 18,000 Renal's bands, which is pretty good. Okay, teleporter is done. I see one more sneaky little item over here. What do you got for me? Fuel cell uh, makes absolutely no difference, but I will take it nonetheless. Our first red is Mead Hook. Okay. I'm not, I don't think I hate that. I don't think I'm super upset about that. I do kind of want to get hit one time. 
So if something can hit me like once, maybe you, maybe you hit me once, maybe you just hit me one time. There we go. Okay, enough money to loot the whole stage. Let's kill everything on the stage. Jesus. And uh, let's get looting. Brooch is fine. We're skipping crit. We're grabbing here. Looking for Plimp. Oh, that's not it. I do... I'll take a needle tick, though. I think that could be really nice. Oh, our first armor piercers. This should mean we one-shot Mithrix. I don't know what he could get that would stop us at this point, other than potentially a Dio's, but I don't know. The chances of that are low. Okay, so this is intriguing, right? That's intriguing. I, I don't know if we necessarily want to take it. I, I don't know if we want to crash the game like that, just like that. But we will take one of these a hundred percent. Oh, that's some quick attack speed. And then this is what happens when I use my secondary bunch. So that's, that's scuffed. We get another void cradle over here looking for plimp. I'm just trying to get as much stuff as I can. Uh, we'll take another one of these though. That's for sure. Okay. We are ready. The meat hook has not come into play. And we are all right with that overloading gup. Oh, wait, actually, hold on. Oh, oh, that was loud. But that was, uh, that was that. That was very easily dealt with with the wave clear that we have. Thank goodness we picked it up. Otherwise, that would have taken a little bit. And maybe we risk, like, a fire band hitting us. I, that's the thing. The, the math is so large and ridiculous. I actually don't know if 2,000 fire bands would kill us or if it would do absolutely nothing. It's such a large amount of damage, it's hard to know. Stage five has been complete. Time to figure out what item Mithrix gets here. 2,000 fire bands is a little scary for things like pizza. What does he get? It is. Oh, it's not red. He gets a mocha. Okay. <laughs> so, so he gets a thousand mocha. I don't know how to feel about that. Is that a really bad thing? I don't know. It means every enemy out here is going to be insanely fast. Way too fast for their own good. Mythrix is going to be hard to hit. I think this is going to be peak... Look at... Look at... <laughs> look at the wisps! Look at them go! You guys have no idea where you even are, do you? You have no clue. One of them is stuck. One of them is... Or two of them are just absolutely losing it. I mean, so is... So is Mercenary, to be fair, right now. This is wild. I kind of want to go look for my little lockbox, but at the same time, like, do we really need to? I don't think so. Actually, you know what we should do? We should make sure there's no Dio's over there. I am going to go over. I know the attack speed on these guys is going to be phenomenally fast, but I do think it's worth it just to go... Hey, guys, what are you, what are you doing? How, how are the vibes over here? You guys seem to move in a little bit too fast for your own good. I don't know how scary they are. I'm just going to do this. Thank you so much. And then let's go look for a Dio's. Okay, up on the top, it's looking like shurikens, which I actually will take. I'll take a thousand shurikens with our attack speed. Come on, watch this. Watch this. You guys are not ready. And shurikens. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's like every thousand item video. We have to have shurikens and attack speed. But down here, looking at ignition tank. We're looking at uh what whatever that's called let's look for a guillotine let's look for oh what is this drone man's cool we'll take it because we have the regen scrap why not but looking for that dios i don't think there is a dios here unless there's one hidden right here no all right we are going in with one life that is all we get i don't see our little uh, our little guy our little friendly void pod but that's all right we really really don't need it let's uh Let's make our way up, people. All right, if you have gotten to this point in the video, hit that subscribe button. We are jumping in. Mythrix is going to be hella quick. I just have to hit him one time, right? We don't have to hit him a lot, just one time, but he's going to be fast. I don't know how fast he's about to be, but I know it's going to be a little insane. Where is he? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, uh, Mythrix, my dude. I don't know how you expect me to hit you, I'm just going to go up here because he keeps seeming to hit this edge. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, he's so quick. Boom. Oh, I thought I had it there. Let's just... Okay, wait. We can shuriken all around, right? We can just kind of shuriken up in this area. And that is so many shurikens. We might be able to get him on the way by. Let's just... Let's hope. Let's hope we can get him on the way by. He might be at our level now. Oh, we just... This is so hard. <laughs> he's so fast. Whoa. All right. Where'd he go? Is he stuck? Oh, he got, did he get, oh, he didn't get stuck. Look at him just zip around this place. He gets stuck some places like that. 
and then we might be able to actually mess with him. I feel like we need to get on an edge. Whoa! Mithrix, are you okay? Sir, we got him. Okay, now we give an absolutely insane phase two where everything is... Oh, he... Oh, they're not doing well. Oh, they are not doing well. Somebody check on these guys. They are not doing well. I've saved them of their misery. Let's see if I can get him here. Let's see if I can get him before he runs away. We did, we did. No fire ban, though. Oh, I think we... Did we kill him? No, that, that doesn't look good for me. That doesn't look good for me. This, this is, this is not, hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is not good. We need to be ready for absolutely anything right now. We, sometimes we get to kill him with cheese. I don't know if that's going to be how we're doing it today. I, I think, oh, 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 okay. Okay. Yeah, so that, so we didn't win that. We didn't win that at all. You would think with, uh, thousands of fire bands, we'd make that happen. Simply not the case. I hope you guys all enjoyed nonetheless. If you enjoyed enemies getting 1,000 items too, I figured I'd try to balance the scales a little bit. But again, all up to RNG. I hope you all enjoyed. And with that being said, I will see you next time.